So now in the middle of October is a great time to plant your bulbs. And all you need to do, it's, it's really very simple. When you take out a bulb, these happen to be crocus, it's a fairly small bulb, okay? So no matter what the size of the bulb is, you wanna plant a, about one and a half to two times the size of the bulb, you wanna plant it that deep. So a little tiny bulb like this does not have to go very deep. So it's a matter of just, you know, um, what you'll see on the bags, it's just a matter of dig, put it in with the point up, drop it, and cover it over, and you're done. Now, some people, and I, myself included, like to put a little bit of fertilizer, or especially root fertilizer, to get the roots started this time of the year. And so you can do the same thing, uh, no matter what size bulb, I'm going to take a bulb that's a little bit bigger. There, here's a, a good sized daffodil bulb. So once again, you're going to have to plant this one out a little bit deeper because it's a much bigger bulb. So one and a half to two times, two and a half times the size of the bulb is how deep into the ground it has to go. So dig yourself a deeper hole for a bulb like this. If you want to plant, put a little bit of fertilizer in, put it on the bottom of the hole, put a little tiny bit of soil on top of that, and then plant your bulb in there and cover it over. Remember, so there's always a pointy side up. Um, so some people have a hard time with that. It's, it's you know, the, the side that's got, you know, it's fairly flat. It looks like there might be roots coming out of it. And then there's a pointy side, just whether it's a tulip or a hyacinth or daffodil, it's going to have a pointy side. And that's the side that has to go up. If you plant them about this time of the year, mid-October, they're going to come up at the pr appropriate time. Nothing's going to freeze. You know, the crocuses and things like that and, and little miniature tete -tete daffodils will come up first snowdrops will come up first and then you'll be followed by tulips and daffodils and hyacinths a little bit later there are early mid and late season tulips for instance so you know your tulips don't come up all, all at the same time don't get excited because there are different stages in which they'll come up and usually tulips are some of the last things to come up but they will come up okay so once again um, it's just a matter of what they say is dig, drop, and done. But now, in the next couple of weeks, is the time that you want to plant these bulbs. You don't want to wait until it gets too cold. If you planted them in early September, sometimes it can be a little too early because they'll actually root in and start to come up, and then they can freeze. We just had a hard freeze, and that's not really good for them. So now is a great time to do that. Once again, one and a half to two times the size of the bulb, plant them in and just cover them over and then give them a good watering. You give them a good watering, that's all they need and they will come up and give you lots of pleasure for years to come. If you have any questions about how to plant bulbs or you want some more information, come on into Four Seasons and we'll be happy to help you any way we can. Thank you.